Hello, Aladdin and Kerosene Lamp fans. I'm gonna shoot a video this week uh, up at my cottage up in the North Corth. It's uh, end of October. Um, snow's gonna come soon. Gotta shut the uh, water down because this place is not, it's, you know, winter cottage. So I'm just gonna shoot some of the lamps that, uh, some pictures of the lamps that I use up here. The power goes out or this time of year when uh, it gets cold so I just got up here a couple hours ago and it's uh, it was pretty darn cold uh, got the window open just a little crack of course and uh, I'm running some of my lamps and I got my propane stove and I have another wall lamp here and I do have a kerosene heater going I'll probably shut that off in a couple of minutes to put it I put it outside and shut it off so it doesn't fume up but that uh, gets it from really cold to really fast in here within about an hour and a half so uh between i guess these are between two and three thousand btus so i got one two three four five so we'll say that's say, 12 or thirteen thousand btus and then twenty thousand there and twenty three thousand there so uh forty uh, fifty thousand btus that's a full-size furnace at your house so uh Anyway, I just run these just to speed the heating process up if I come up in the middle of the winter. Um, and uh, very effective. But uh, some of the lamps I got here, this is a uh, an old shade on a newer style green, emerald green drape. Uh, it's, it's not on full intensity right now. Um, it's got a bit of a slight uh, <clears throat> overburn to one side. So next time I light it, I'm going to have to really clean the wick and play around with the uh, outer uh, wick too to make sure it doesn't flame up the one side, but these were all hand painted. And they make a new one as well too, it looks very similar. But this um, log cabin one actually came off this one I have up over here in the corner that it came on this one here. I got it in Peterborough, I think. I just electrified, oops, that just for quick electricity but anyway so I threw it on that one it looks good and that's just one I burn once in a blue moon and but these other ones here are more of my workhorses so these are you know either max break 500s or 23s and genie uh, glass bases that one's kind of like a, a smoked amethyst and then I, I like this swirl shade so I got sort of the green job there then I have a, a, a light blue one here that's got a 23 burner on it, it came with a 500 but I moved it somewhere else and that's uh, just a, a new Aladdin swirl shade. Uh, over in this corner here, uh, this, is, this one really kind of cranks out because it doesn't have a, a shade on it. So that's a, a wall sconce um, done by Aladdin Canada out of Aurora, Ontario back in the 70s and 80s, late 70s, early 80s. I got a couple of these, I like them. Um, traditional style lamp. And then this one over here I picked up uh, earlier on this year. So it came with a different uh, glass font. It was, um, but this is a handmade one done by a, um, I think it was a, a furniture maker in Bracebridge. Anyway, um, I uh, basically bought it for the wall bracket. And then I put this 23 burner on it. This is my best 23 burner I own. And it cranks out, it's a, it's a real 40, 50 watt bulb. Uh, I don't think it's even on full intensity right now, but so between all this, I'm running light in here right now and it's starting to get pretty warm. And uh, you know, pretty soon I'll start shutting them down. A couple of things, guys, if you want to shut lamps down, you don't want them to smell as much. One thing that I use, and I probably showed this before in my earlier videos, is these little ramekins, stainless steel ones. You can get them on uh, Amazon for six bucks for a half dozen or whatever. And uh, I blow it out and just put that on real quick, and it stops the uh, stops it from fuming. It also uh, protects it later on in case a bug wants to fly down and destroy your uh, destroy your uh, mantle while you're not here. So uh, anyway, dog likes it. Dog sleeping, nice and cozy in here already. Uh, sorry, I haven't done too many videos. I've been really busy at work. It's my busy time at work. Travel a lot, and it's cutting into my collecting, but. Uh, Gonna be looking at a collection next month. I'm gonna be hopefully shooting a video there uh, and helping the uh, people, uh, you know, liquidate some of the lamps because there's another big assortment of lamps and so many that I, I can't even digest them all. So, 
But anyway, thanks, uh, thanks for watching. And if you guys have any suggestions on what you want to see on Aladdin lamps or kerosene lamps in general, uh, just shoot me a video or shoot, uh, send me a text or, and uh, I'll see what I can do. Uh, thanks for watching.